Brad Halston, owner of this place. Former indoor football player who got stuck in a job that just didn't do it for me. So I finally opened up my own place, the Burger Dive. Besides my kids, my wife, I love this place more than anything in the world. Nathan, constantly going to bad restaurants, constantly coming in and telling us about them. Hey guys, I went to China Quick last night. Stop. Yeah. Why? I, I was hungry. I wanted sushi. Oh, quick Chinese. It made my tummy hurt. Huh. Tummy. How was it? Disgusting. It, it was pretty gross. Yeah. So you go to a Chinese restaurant that has a drive-up window, right? Yeah. yeah. And you order sushi in your shop. After telling us three weeks ago how bad it was, that it was bad. Yeah. Because what I said, China Cafe or nowhere else. When will you run? Yeah. I'm not going to. That's for sure. Yeah, I, 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 I always suck. What kind of mind would not instantly understand drive away, not through the window, drive away? I, I, I'm out. I don't even know. I'm, I'm going to sit down. I can, I can show you how to end it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Stop talking for the rest of the day. Guys, what are we going to listen to? I would like to listen to NPR, <laughs> the jazz. Quiet. Nobody listens to that in the whole state. Can I get one down on the bed? Pardon? Nobody listens Thank to that you. in this whole state. In the entire state. I appreciate it. Dude, they are still producing music that wasn't made in the 16th century. Nathan, Grandpa, constantly battling with each other. But I got a great song for you. No, no, and no. You come back here. Pretty much anything that makes Grandpa upset works for me. Nathan. Grandpa's been on my ass about this whole Red Solo Cup thing. Red Solo Cup. Turn that trash off right now. This is partly produced trash. The tone of this song has a half a song stem where I have no technical. I, I know I'm older, but I can still bring it. I apologize for having a monogram of class, the sense of Atlanta intelligence. I'm sorry that you don't. The little battle between those two guys make my day. Oh, I'm, I'm sitting down on orders to If I hear that damn thing again, somebody's going down. I wanted to get him good. I succeeded. I, I, I'm out. I don't even know. I'm going to sit down. You okay, bud? Always. Yeah, sorry about that. You should be. Yeah, yesterday was a birthday. I forgot to get you something. So I got you something. Oh, yeah. Nice. Yeah, yeah. I went out of my way, you know. I, I I'm take that much of what I call the symbol. Yes, I'm very poor. Not all. Well, you're going to love it. Just, just hold oh, on to that for a moment. Really? Yeah, I must be sorry. Yeah. You have to know it to understand his simplicity. I think he's joking most of the time. Anyway. I worked really hard on this. All night. Happy birthday, bud. <laughs> I don't happen to find it funny. Perhaps some people will. Okay, I you got your own cup and testicles. Welcome to the family, bud. Watch me walk away. Oh, I don't think you like this. Just downright. Yeah, that was my last like six bucks. Hey, buddy. Hey, nothing to talk on the phone. Come on. That's that. Yeah. I have something in store for this show. <laughs> Thank you.
Grandpa got me really good with my phone. I warned him, didn't I? Didn't I warn him? No. Mess with Grandpa at your own peril. I didn't even know he even knew how to use something so technologically advanced. We just gave you a little sliver of the funny things that happen on around here almost on a daily basis. Uh, I guess you'll have to stay tuned for the rest. <laughs>